Hello friends and welcome to Assassin's Creed 3 Let's Play. I'm your host Alpana the Mexican and we need to talk to this awesome mustachioed man. Our bitch, Charles Lee. Good evening, gentlemen. Oh god. Charming. Oh, peace, Charles. He'll grow on you. Oi! Catherine, you fussock! Get back here! Daddy needs a drink! <laughs> How fares the search? Maths and maps are not cutting it. What of your local contacts? We'll need to earn their trust before they'll share what they know. <sighs> Oh, I've an idea on how we might be affecting that. There's a man who's taken to enslaving natives. Oh, she Rescue loves them. And she they loves them. Do you know where they're being held? Afraid not. Benjamin Churchwill. He's a finder and a fixer. He's also on your list. And there I was wondering whom I might solicit next. Well done. I like him. Charles Lee is a nice person. I wish he was Hathen Kenway. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. Never mind. I just, I don't like Hathen. He kind of seems like a dick. Look at me. I have a cool little ponytail wrapped in a red string. Yeah. So literally today, all I've been doing is playing Assassin's Creed 3 um, multiplayer. Like, that's all I've been doing. Did I say welcome to Assassin's Creed Revelations? That's embarrassing. I am so sorry about that, guys. Hmm. Anybody home? Kick it open. Wonderful. You what? You should just kick it open. There you go, Charles. I love you. Good job. Hmm. Curious. Charles. <laughs> Sir. Seems like we're not the only ones looking for Mr. Church. Damn it, he could be anywhere. What do we do? We find him. That looks like an oddly pixelated painting. Come. Huh. I'll show you how. Okay. Well, I guess that's one way to do it. One thing I'm a little confused about is if the hidden blades can like spin into knives, how is it they can still cut sideways? Is there like a button that releases them and activates them into knives or something? I don't know. I'm just kind of curious about those things. Whoa. Not our business to meddle, even if we've the best of intentions. But if you could have seen it, they were surely drunk carrying on like that, and during the day no less. Washington has surrendered Fort Necessity to French forces. Oh, okay. Well, my screen is stuck, so I can't. There we go. Two civilians to blend. Oh, these civilians. Oh, oh, that's embarrassing. I'll kill him. Ah. Okay. All right. I was a little confused because the screen was frozen and other things like that. This time I'll know what to do though. Okay, I've got to walk up and eavesdrop on Ben Church's neighbors while hidden. Which is what I'm gonna do right about now. It's not letting me run, by the way, guys. I'm not choosing to nonchalantly walk up here. Not our business to meddle. Even if we've the best of intentions. Craftsman Peter Witzel has contracted a demonstration of his they were surely drunk carrying on like that, and during the day, no less. Oh, hey. When the SSI fills with yellow, it means the target is suspicious. Once it is filled, the meter becomes red. Move between two civilians to blend with them. Okay, let me move the camera and I shall do as such. Thank you very much. Scandalous behavior from one who aims to be a surgeon. Not likely if he keeps up such carousing. Truly a shameful display. Benjamin's parents would be mortified. Perhaps I should send someone to retrieve him before he damages his reputation beyond repair. They stumbled off to the northeast, no doubt in search of a tavern or some other place of ill repute. Start questioning those on the street. I'm headed for higher ground. 
I'll see you later, my bitch. Bye bye now. Look at my flowing robes and whatnot. Oh, I actually I've been playing this game, uh, not the story mode, and I found out that Hatham can't even do tree free running. That's just a Connor thing. So um, yeah, that's something to look forward to when we play as Connor. I mean, if this is just a little part, like an intro thing for um, the, the game, like, this is looking to be a really huge game. I mean, if, if Haytham is just the beginning, then, yeah, see, look, you can't even climb on trees. What a noob. See, so, yeah, we're just going to try and get to that objective marker as soon as possible. Oh, I have good news to anybody who has ever heard of multi-PPL productions. He is sort of the father of YouTube for me and Sir Gustavo, who is another one of my um, friends on YouTube. He is back on the back on the horse, her, back in the saddle, I don't know. He just uploaded a video about XCOM multiplayer. If you're interested in seeing it, check it out. I'll put his link in the description. Um, for those of you guys who haven't seen him, he's actually, I think he's really funny. Maybe that's just sort of an opinion because I don't know how, but he has less subscribers than me. And I don't think that's just, ooh. Bald Eagle, America. Synchronize. Whoa. I don't even know if that's possible, what he's doing right there. Time to take a listen. With luck, one of those people knows what became of Benjamin. That was awesome. Okay, time to eavesdrop on people. Should I get on the roof? Is that a good idea? I don't know. Time to find out. Eavesdrop on these people. Um. Okay. I need to jump down. Jump down unsuspectingly. I've asked the priors, but they all plead ignorance. Bugger that! They're lying! Aye. Well, what can I do? Threats light off them, and I'll not deign to grovel. Actions speak louder than words, my friend. Arrest one and put him in stocks. See if he's so glib then. To do so without cause will set them singing songs about us. Last thing the city needs is town criers complaining about our abuse of authority. Then forget it. The crime is done. The killer's gone. Those who know won't share their secrets. If the city wishes to harbor scoundrels, let them pay the price for it. Hmm, okay then. Oh, so this is one of the new stalking grounds. You guys didn't know. I think it's actually really cool. I wanna kill him. Noob! Alright, gotta get some more eavesdroppies up in here. The free running is so fluid. I mean, you guys have no idea. You guys just need to play it to understand, really. And I feel bad because the people who haven't played the previous Assassin's Creed's Specifically, Assassin's Creed 1 really can't appreciate it as much as other people can for that exact reason. And I'm actually running out of breath when I'm talking. That's how much I'm talking right now. Alright, gotta go over there. And the animals just walking along the city, it's so cool to see. You can actually, I think you can pet the animals. Let's find out right now. Pet animal. Whoa! You can just generate food. Ugh. Sorry, my hand just puked. Did not feel good. And they waved me away. Insisted it was all under control. How odd. Did they say what had happened? Oh, God. No. Only that it was a party last night. And he'd be returned home soon. There was some blood, though. So I wonder if it wasn't more serious than they let on. Where were they taking him? Towards the hilltop. Perhaps there's a doctor at the fort. Hmm. The thing is, I'm not even paying attention to the conversation, which is probably not a good thing, but whatever, you guys can listen in, right? I'm staying quiet for you, not for me, because I honestly don't care. I just want to kill things. I mean, this is Assassin's Creed, not Eavesdrop's Creed. Let me climb. I want to climb things. Climb. If anybody understands that reference, you are my hero, and we can get along finally. The new vantage points are actually really cool. Uh, uh, why can't I? Oh, oh gosh. No, no, no. Don't drop. 
There we go. Okay, that was strange, but no matter, problem solved. So badass. All right, where is the, there it is. Good look at that about it. But one way or another, the debt would be settled. I don't envy the man. He's grim times ahead. Well, what do you think they're planning? All I know is it can't be good. Cutter was with him. Probably looking for a nice, quiet place to do the deed. From what I hear tell, his work usually involves quite a bit of screaming. Which reminds me, we'd best not buy any meat tomorrow. Ew. <laughs> good call, that. Another thing I appreciate. Whoa. We'll have church hey. in no time. Just as I said we would. If I might ask, sir, where did you learn to do all this? It is a requirement when you are raised in the manner that I was. The Boston hmm, quiet. Let's go. Perception is fundamental to the order. It guides the feet when running and climbing, informs the hands when striking and biting. But the most... Whoa, whoa, ally, come on. Do you not know how to free run, Charles? Is this some kind of a joke? Jeez. All right, let's go. Slowpoke. Do you know how to run? Yeah, you know how to run. That's good. Noobs don't know how to free run. Careful. The place is well guarded. We need to slip past them. Indeed. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. We're good. Oh, he can free run. What's going on then? Okay. Wow, the rooftops made this mission so much easier. All right, and there's some guards just looking out into the sea for some fun reason. It's locked. locked. That's not good. Mm. I'll have to find the key. Wait here. What? There are guards surrounding him. Okay. All right, there's a guy right there. Just gonna silent assassinate him. Shh. Oh gosh. Okay, hopefully that didn't attract too much attention. I just need to loot this body. Whoa! He just had a little rigor mortis thing going on there. Did I already find it? I found the uh, found the key. First try. That's pretty lucky. Here we are then. So I don't know how soon I'm actually going to upload this video. I just really had the urge to play Assassin's Why Creed 3. Why must you always make these things so difficult, Benjamin? Merely provide me with recompense, and all shall be forgiven. I'll not pay for protection I don't need. Clearly, you do require protection. Else we wouldn't be here. Oh. How very gooch. Gooch. Now. What shall we do about our guest? Maybe I take his hands. Put an end to his surgery. Maybe I take his tongue. Put an end to his waggling. Or maybe I take his cock. Oh gosh. Put an end to his fucking us. Huh. I like that pun. So many options. I can't possibly decide. Take all three. No, hold a moment. Perhaps I was hasty in refusing you earlier. I'm so very sorry, Benjamin. But that door has closed. Be reasonable, Silas. I rather think I was. But you took advantage of my oh. generosity. I won't be made a fool a second time. I fear I lack the constitution to bear witness to such barbarism. Uh, lack Come the constitution. 
get it because the American Revolution you hasn't happened me? yet. I'll have your head. But no. I'm joke. I rather think you won't. Oh, just cut his nose. Ah. Lucky and passed out. Though I dare say I'll do me best to ensure that doesn't happen. No, I need to kill this guy. No, I need I need to uh. make myself a nice keepsake, I will. Alright, let's go. Come on! Battle Royale. Wow, you guys are the worst guards I've ever seen. Good work, Charles. Oh, there we go. Who are you? Haytham Kenway, at your service. I... I, I don't understand. Oh, his nose. Why are you here? Walk with me, Mr. Church. Oh my gosh. And all will be explained. Okay. Where, where is he? He's not here. I'm assuming I need to go in here. Hello there, Charles. How are you doing today? There we go. He's got stitches now. Johnson's All told better. Johnson's what you intend. As it happens, the man who held me is the same one that you seek. His name is Silas Thatcher. That fancy lad is our slaver. Don't let his velvet tongue deceive you. A crueler and more vicious creature I've never known. What can you tell me of his operation? He hosts at least a hundred men, more than half of whom are redcoats. All this for some slaves? <laughs> Hardly. The man's a commander in the King's troop, in charge of the Southgate Fort. We need to find a way inside. Hmm, let me think on it. In the meantime, I'll attend to our final recruit. John Pitcairn's our man. I'll take you to him. What's with your eyes, Charles? That was scary. Did you guys see that? He had no white in his eyes. They were all just slightly green. Like an alien. Okay. So, last mission of the episode. Let's do it. Come on. Start mission. What's happening? It's things like this that could have so easily have been prevented in pre-production. I don't really understand. State your business. New recruit. There we go. He's got eyes. More kindling for the pyre, eh? Well, go on then. How did you manage that? Did you forget, sir? My commission is with General Braddock. When I'm not attending to you, of course. Ah, oh, so he's got some connections on the inside, too. I like Charles more and more. He's just a nice person. And he has a way better ponytail than Haytham. Okay, so where are we going, Charles? Again, you fool! Your acts are treacherous. Give me one good reason. I shouldn't kill you right now. Were you planning to announce yourself? Or did you hope my men Sir, wouldn't notice your arrival? If you'll allow me to explain. Ho <laughs> oh, ho! Oh, by all means. I should like very much to hear this. I have not deserted, sir. I am here under Commander Amherst's orders. Show me a letter bearing his seal, and you might be spared the gallows. I have no such thing. The nature of my work, sir. It's, it's the sort of thing best not put to paper. Hey, them. General Braddock? I suppose I shouldn't be surprised. Wolves often travel in packs. Master Pitcairn won't be here for but a few weeks. I shall return him to his proper post once our work is finished. The devil's work, no doubt. It's bad enough my superiors have insisted. I grant you use of Charles. But they said nothing about this traitor. You'll not have him. Edward, listen to reason. We're done here. See these gentlemen out. Okay, I'm a little confused as to who this Edward Braddock person is. Um. 
Yeah. I don't know who that is. Well, that didn't go as I expected. I just think I used to call him brother. What now? They'll chase us off if we try and return. We're done with this camp. And as luck would have it, so are they. Come along. Annie. To steal Master Pitcairn. You'll see. Now. When I give the signal, you're to distract Braddock's patrol and lure them into a dead end. Okay. Um. By Royal Charter, King's College has been created in New York Colony. I mean, am I supposed to do anything right now or just follow them? Where should we? Perhaps down Marlborough. No. Its residents are too content. Their homes are nice. They what? Wait, what? Yes. Why was I desynchronized? This is bullshit. Two desynchronizations in one episode? It's what too are many. To steal it's too Master many. Pitcairn. You'll see. Now, when I give the signal, you're to distract Braddock's patrol and lure them into a dead end. I'll do some free running. Maybe that'll help. Oh, I mustn't keep them out of my line of sight. Where should we head next? Perhaps down Marlborough? No. Its residents are too. Nice. What of Lynn or Ship Street? Yeah. Am I going to be able to make it? Oh, no, 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 no. I won't. Oh, that was so worth it. Free running for the win. So I'm sorry if this episode gets a little long. I'm just kind of very intrigued by the game and don't want to stop. Just got to keep my distance. Just wait. The time will come. I don't know now. exactly what I'm waiting for. Now? He said now. Oi! You thieves and scoundrels, one and all! On you and your false war. <laughs> oh. Excuse me. After him. You'll pay for that. Okay, what do I do now? I gotta save him or something, don't I? Follow Lee and ambush Braddock's patrol. What just happened? What is this? I, that was so weird. I don't even understand what just happened. Unhand him, Edward. Uh, you again. Let us go. And John Pitcairn with us. <laughs> I will not have my authority challenged. Nor I. Put them all in chains. I'm sure you will. Come on, you gotta try harder than that to get me. You guys are all very untrained, poorly equipped, and ill prepared. You are an embarrassment to society. Everybody dead? That's it? Now there's a couple more. Or like 10 more. I keep trying to lock on to the enemy, and it's not working very well. Come on. Oh, oh, that was embarrassing. There we go. Any more? Any more people that we need to deal with? Oh, how did I fall? Come on, Hatham. You need to get your shit together. I stayed my hand today because you were once my brother. And a 
better man than this. Or should our paths ever cross again? All debts will be forgotten. You're free now, John. Traitor! Go on, then. Join them on their fool's errand. And when you find yourself lying... I assume broken, you've good reason for causing all this madness. What is it you require of me? I'll explain everything on the way. Okay. I think that's it for this episode of Assassin's Creed 3. Let's play. Hopefully you guys liked. If you did, please give it a like. Add to favorites. That really helps a lot. Like, seriously, guys, adding to favorites is just the best thing ever. And, um, yeah. So, until next time, this is your host, Albana the Mexican, signing off.